Hi everybody, welcome to the Emirates Stadium in North London. I'm Martin Tyler and alongside me is the former Arsenal striker, Alan Smith. Manchester City have come relatively late to prominence, haven't they? They've had their injection of cash and the richness of resources has led to richness in results. And Arsenal have got their work cut out against the City side. Yeah, well, City and the blueprint are... team here and I fancy it to be close. It was a big move really to leave Barcelona to join Arsenal Alexis Sanchez wasn't it? Well he's a top player isn't he? In perpetual motion really never stops but whoever's marking him today would be well advised to just show him down the left because he's so strong on his right foot. As for Raheem Sterling, he's one of those players where get him on the ball anywhere inside the goal and he can create an opening, he can unlock the door. This is the Arsenal lineup. Pericek starts in goal. Monreal starts alongside Hector Bellerin in the fullback positions. Santi Cazorla starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the park. Olivier Giroud is the main striker. Manchester City's lineup today. Willy Caballero starts in goal. Macri Sanya starts with Alexander Kolarov as the fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Fernandinho in the middle of the park. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. Big decision for Arsenal to up sticks from Highbury. A splendid stadium, but a small one by modern standards. And they've uh, increased the capacity to over 60,000, and they make a lot of money with every home game. So I guess it's been worth the effort, even though a lot of that money was not going into the team for a period of time when they weren't winning trophies. No, but they've come through that period now, so we're led to believe. And there's not a bad seat in the house here. The the actual seats are much bigger than the used to it for ball ground. So much thought's gone into it. Hector Berry. Santi Cazola. Attacking well here. And here's the shot. He's blocked that well. Nolito. Aguero probing away trying to find room for a shot maybe Silva he's got support here Abrana. and he can clear it here that would be a throw on the attack here Sanya! Oh, and a possible... Well, they've broken through here. So a really good goal. And the celebrations reflect that. The supporters are going crazy. It's a terrific moment for the team. A goal from Sterling. And that's the mark of a man playing with a lot of confidence out there today. To take it on first time. Hit it hard, bottom left. That has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. Aaron Ramsey. Came in with a challenge. Kevin De Bruyne. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. And they've cut it out. Sanchez. Here. And there's the interception. Doing well to keep the ball. This could be a chance. Aguero! He slides. 
sliced through them, sliced them apart. Oh, he's just got overexcited there. We all thought he was going to score. Santi Cazola. Olivier Giroud. Tremendous understanding from these players. Place to try and hit it now. A oh, well saved. Well, that's gone back to the goalkeeper. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Well, this is great teamwork, the way they're knocking the ball around. Santi Cazola! One back by Bakary Sanya. Kevin De Bruyne. There's good progress with this attack. This could be it. Just working away to try and find an opening. Silva. Attacking well here. Here the challenge is a good one. Mesut Ozil. Good passing here. And he can take possession in his own half. It's gone out for a throw. Mesut Ozil. Santi Cazola. Well, he's threaded the path through neatly. The court official has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes. Meeting. In with the chance. And here's the shot. What a fine save. And that's half-time. Signaled by the referee. 1-0 the half-time score. Raheem Sterling to the four in the first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. Ozil. There's some potential in this move. Kolorov. Sergio Aguero. Kevin De Bruyne. Aguero. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Here the challenge. Good one. Aaron Ramsey. And here comes the counter-attack. Really strong challenge by Sanya. And he's away now. Aguero. It's looking good, this move. Free kick against Aguero. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch. Now he's a bit disappointed. He's going to be taken off here. And... The manager may be saving him for another day, but also allowing him to get the full appreciation from the fans. Well, he was enjoying it. I don't think he wanted to come off, but uh, he's a key part of this team. He's got to be protected. Coming onto the pitch, number 42, Real 
Mesut Özil. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. There goes the cross. David Silva! Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely, and that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. Well, take another look at this, Alan Smith. You'd have been proud of this one. Well, he timed the jump and he timed the header perfectly. A wonderful example of how to head the ball. Restarting at 2 0. Manchester City, number 21. Giving the opposition a problem with their interpassing. Jack Wilshire. Could be dangerous. For Manchester City, the substitute is ready. He can lay it off to the supporting player. Jack Wilshire! Gone for goal in spectacular style. Wow. I was expecting him to be wheeling away in celebration there. To be replaced by number 14, Phil Walcott. They've decided to make a change, and being behind, you can understand that. Malika to be replaced by number 19, Leo Osama. Sterling substitute for Manchester City just a quick check on the clock and there are 20 minutes to go Kevin De Bruyne this is how they love to play on the break a lot of defenders between them and the goal but they still got the ball and the referee spotted that deflection he's pointed for the corner and they're going to make this change now. Oh, he's done well. He's got his goal from midfield. Yeah, he's had a good, solid game. And passed the ball well. And got that goal, as you say. Well done. Rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. Throw in to come. And now here on the attack is Aguero. Kevin De Bruyne comes in with a tackle. And it is a goal kick. Well, the Manchester City fans expect things to go wrong in the last few minutes. That's what's happened to their team in uh, many, many decades in the past. But not for this club, not for this team. It's going to be happiness. Yeah, I can't see any shocks now in the remaining minutes. And the fans, listen to them. Oh, as confident as you like. Ten minutes left of regular time going to be a substitution for Arsenal now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting Sergio Aguero coming forward looking for an opening with some good control build-up he went in well Olivier Giroud Nicholas Otamendi. They spread it out wide here. We could be in. And the keeper can collect this one. Here's Walcott. 
And the added time will amount to three minutes at least. Three minutes. Giroud in the cut off. What a fine save. Ozil. The shot's off. And in he goes with the tackle. Final whistle. It's Manchester City's match. A shining light for his side today was Raheem Sterling. Oh, lots of energy, lots of quality, and a good goal, along with plenty of chances. And as for Alexis Sanchez, he was, of course, on the wrong end of the result.